I'm on a mission to try a burrito from every establishment that has to offer in San Francisco. I always go to the same establishment, so I'm gonna give a try and I'm gonna give it a rating from all the burritos that I'm gonna eat. So we're here tonight at Chewy's Fiesta's Taqueria Numero Dos. It's on Post Street and Jones. I think it's new. I've never heard of it before. So I'm excited for my burrito to come out. I got a super shrimp burrito. Got my burrito. It's massive. So I got a super shrimp burrito. Ooh, it's busting already. Let's see how it goes. There is a show. Lots of flavor. So everything immediately you can tell they love using peppers. That has a really nice taste to it. See that fly? The offer is salsa. I'm going in without trying it. Not spicy, but it's good. Mm -hmm. Good question. So it's unraveling already halfway. But it has so much punch to it. Look at that cheese. The peppers are so fresh. Let's see. No drippage. I like that. Cool. It's a little, a little floppy. Big shrimps. This is a super, but I'm getting full. Doesn't need salsa. 
It's good on its own. It stands strong. The man did offer a choice of uh, pinto beans, smash, or black. I chose pinto. And basically they have a piece of rubber that you push in and it too, uh, like a push it off the smell. Yeah, so, you know, you see it. Jenner with the sour cream. Real generous. I don't know if you saw my baby. I made a... So, I've seen it on YouTube. Yeah, I was like, oh, I do. It's totally real strong. Yeah, I mean, it's not something like you do all the time, but it burns, it is very slow. And it's like clean. Um, so everything's made to order for sure. The rice is hella hot. Nice. Still at the very end. It's just so warm. Yeah, so basically you get the banana peel. You shave off uh, the excess banana stuff, then you put it in the microwave for a little bit, like 20 seconds, and then put, put the rest on. And then you're only willing to put it in the microwave to dry it out a little bit, but you don't want to pull it over. So I did the microwave in the uh, and then I did the tea. And it was still a little too damp, so I did like this, like uh, with a lighter. But once I actually got it going, have you ever smoked a cigar? Yeah. Okay. So with a cigar, like, I think it's like, with the center, it's so big, like your ash stays there, like at the bit. So when I was doing with the banana leaf, like the ash stayed there. It wasn't even ash, it was like dark. It was kind of hot, but it stayed there, like whatever I was done. But it burned super slow. I was like really surprised. It was good. Yeah. Um, so, like I do with I like the uniqueness of the flavor. Shrimp with the peppers that they got going on. Really good. Consistency is throughout. A lot going on in the burrito estate. Perfect combination of everything. They did, they did not impound the shrimp. I'm so happy with that. But the construction, a little floppy, not that firm. If I was to eat that to go, you know, we might have issues. So my rating out of five, I'm gonna have to say, a good four, four out of five. And they have a bunch of other burritos to try. Even a breakfast burrito that I'm very interested in. That's my take.